Leadless pacemakers are the latest in medical technology to help maintain heart rhythm. Let's hear what our expert has to say about the symptoms and indications that determine the need for leadless pacemaker implants. Leadless pacemaker, invisible pacemaker, tiny pacemaker is usually indicated in patients where the regular pacemakers are also indicated for same reason. For example, if their heart rate is going down, they're feeling giddy, they're having loss of consciousness, syncope, or irregular heartbeats, this capsule-like pacemaker is not different from the regular pacemaker, but it is quite a special pacemaker. So this pacemaker has got certain special indications, like people who do not want a regular pacemaker, or people who are very elderly, those who are having blood thinners, their skin is bad, or they had some kind of uh, problem with the regular pacemaker like infections, uh, lead breakage, or repeated infections. Those patients who are having dialysis and especially post-surgery, these are the special populations where these pacemakers are usually implanted in my practice. Apart from health complications, there are a number of reasons why patients themselves prefer leadless pacemakers. Okay, as I said, young people, young ladies, they don't want to have scar on their chest. Since there is no incision, there is no cutting, no pain, it is usually a very small pacemaker inserted through your groin. So we have implanted a uh, few hundreds of pacemakers, but most challenging was there was a girl who had uh, a heart defect in her childhood and was repaired. She had heart block and she had almost three time pacemakers and uh, her pacemaker got infected. Since the girl was very small, uh, it has to be a special technique and she got little pacemaker and she's doing all right. It is a, definitely one of the best innovations in medical science as far as the pacemaker technology is concerned. 